All right, much better today. Um, looked more like football practice instead of soccer. And, um, you know, the football players show up when the noise level goes up. A lot of guys look great in shorts, but uh, they, they disappear when the noise level goes up. And uh, so I, I was really happy to see. I can't wait to grade the tape. Um, good ebb and flow again to practice defense, offense. Um, I thought everybody practice to win rather than practice to practice. And there's a big damn difference. Who stood out to you with the pass today? I have to go watch the film. I mean, I, I don't look at too many guys, but uh, I thought our tight end group looked pretty decent. Bruce, you, you see kicks by guys like Mike Edwards and Devin White had one. Is that good for the defense bad for the offense? Where does that fall? Good for both. I mean, you learn from throwing it. And uh, defense obviously has to get some. We've been short on turnovers in camp. And, uh, you know, Devin's made that play now. He missed it once, and now he's made it twice. So he's, he's getting confidence because quarterback will never see him going back there. So um, he's got to learn too. How did OJ look, and how good was it just to see him out there running around? Uh, he looked fine. You know, can't wait till he can do the whole practice. You know, and uh, but he he looks okay. What about Antonio? Uh, I know you reached the end zone again today. Um, yeah, he's fine. It's, there's no more questions about him. He's ready to roll. We don't think about next week. We can only control today. And all we control is tomorrow. Next week, we'll see, you know. But uh, we do have a game at the end of that week, which makes it a little bit different. But we're still practicing this ourselves until we play that game. So every single day is just take care of today's business. Yeah, it was, it was a vet day. No, they're, they're just at an age and experience level, and it's all scripted out what days what guys get. So it's, uh, it has nothing to do with that. You're seeing guys stacked on the outside when it comes to offense, a bunch uh, sets, a lot of pre snap. Is it safe to say y'all are trying to expand that portion of the offense? Uh, what part? Uh, where you have receivers stacked on the outside, some bunch sets, a lot of pre snap motion, play action. Is it safe to say y'all are trying to expand that side of the offense? No, that's our offense. We've been doing that for 15 years. That's what we do. He's got to get better with bodies on him. That last play, he's got to make that catch. It's going to be grimy. He's got to make more grimy catches. We know he can run by people, but you can't be a one-trick pony in this league. You've got to be able to play with big bodies on you. He's getting better. Uh, Keyshawn's been spot on. You know, I, I really like where he's at. Again, we'll see more in preseason, and uh, he didn't get much of an opportunity in that one. But, uh, yeah, he's, he's, he's where he needs to be. Is the key for him still to, to show what he can do on special teams? Totally, totally. Coach Tyler Johnson made some huge catches last year, but no training camp, all of that. Comes back this year. How did he look in year two for you? I know it's a product this season. Uh, yeah, he came back a little heavy. And he's getting back in shape, which is his own fault. But uh, we know what it, we know he can catch the ball. Now he just got to be able to stay healthy and uh, get in real good shape. How do you assess the performance of camp so far, Ron Jones? Solid. Nothing. He's catching the ball well. He's running the ball well. It's just he's Rojo. Uh, 